hey y'all welcome and welcome back to my channel it is your girl ray if you are new welcome thanks for tuning in thanks for watching today is um december 31st new year's eve happy new year's eve everyone um so right now i'm in the car obviously it is about 11 20 and um i am on my way i'm actually on my way to do a couple of things so hold on let me get let me get situated I'm on my way to do a couple of things. Well, I have a few errands to run. As you can see, my hair is looking real. It's giving real Linus, okay? But I have a hair appointment today. I need to stop past a couple stores. And then I also am trying to, if time allows me, to get my car washed today. Cause you know, December 31st, you gotta make sure you're going into the new year looking right, feeling good, you know? What else is on the schedule? So today is actually um, my brother's birthday and it's also my nephew's birthday. So um, between all the things I have to do, I need to run to the store and get my brother, um, you know, some balloons and have a card. I'm gonna try to get him a, a little cake. Let me clarify, my brother is turning 20, 23? My brother turning 23 and my nephew is turning two. So I just have to clarify that. I know I said I'm getting a cake, but you know. I love birthdays. I think birthdays are fun. And if it's your birthday, I'm gonna celebrate with you. So I literally just left Starbucks. So I saw this um, recipe online, strawberry frappuccino recipe. And on the recipe, it basically said that it was supposed to taste like a strawberry shortcake. Um, so I actually got it yesterday, but I don't think I got, I don't think I did the recipe right. So I went back today and this is what it looks like. Doesn't it look so cute? Ooh, super, super cute. So it actually tastes, y'all know those little, um, strawberry and cream hard candies. That's actually what it tastes like. So what it is. It's just a strawberry cream frappuccino and they added the vanilla, it says vanilla powder, so I guess they just added the vanilla bean powder. If you like strawberry and cream or strawberry, this is a really good drink. It doesn't have any caffeine in it, so at least I don't think so. And of course, um, my staple, I get the um, double smoke bacon cheddar sandwich. If you haven't tried this, you definitely should because it's bomb. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. I just wanted to come on here and kind of give you guys the tea, give you guys the agenda for today. So, um, wish me luck. I cry for the birthday boy. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> Say it's my birthday. It's my birthday. Uh, how old are you? Huh? You tired of me asking you that today? <laughs> <laughs> it's your birthday happy birthday man all right y'all so just a quick little update my hairstylist actually um texted me and said she was running late so in the meantime between time your girl is at the car wash and i'm gonna show you guys see the line isn't too bad that's good um i'm actually kind of happy that i'm getting it done now um oh hold on but yes like i was saying i'm kind of happy that i am washing my car now because this probably would have been the longest thing or the most time consuming thing i had to do so your girl's car about to be clean y'all so i just made it to my i just made it to my hair treatment so i'm about to hurry up and go i'm so excited because this thing needs it needs it needs help y'all the struggle is real
there for me, okay? Comment down Somebody. below if you have, what, what would we call her? She's a struggle side? What, what, what would this be? Yeah. <laughs> A limp side. Well, comment down below if you have a limp side, cause sis over here is always like playing games, and I'm she trying to. Girl. It's okay, but the hair still is still laid and flat. Okay. Hey. Shout out to Jada, the best, hair, <laughs> the best hairstylist. I'll go ahead and leave her info down below. But yes, y'all, she's back. Y'all, can we? Can, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, cause I need some lip gloss. Oh, y'all let's get into this hair okay oh gosh mm. 2021 ha, i'm ready for you okay um okay so right now it is 3 54 so i need to hurry i'm just feeling great like uh my car is clean, the hair is done, like 2021 is feeling awesome. I'm gonna see if my my um my camera will stay up here. Pray that it doesn't fall over because nobody has time. But y'all, can we talk about um how I am like super late on oh my camera about to die, hold on. But yeah, like I was saying, can we talk about how extremely late I was that Wizkid had a new album and how this album is fire? Like, comment down below. Do y'all listen to Wizkid? Because, baby, this album is it. This is my song. Come on with the Afro beats, okay? <sighs> Just, I'm just feeling really good. I'm feeling very excited about all this. But yeah. Hey y'all, happy new year. Happy 2021. We're here, we made it. Um, the last time you saw me, I was kind of like prepping um, for the new year, I guess. It was um, New Year's Eve. But anywho, being that it's a new year, I wanted to do something a little bit different, not too different, but um, the past few years I've been doing memory jars. So basically what a memory jar is, you just take any type of mason jar or whatever kind of jar you want, and the memory jar is used to, you know, collect different items or things that remind you of certain events that happened throughout the year once december 31st comes of that year you open up your memory jar and just kind of reminisce on the year that you had so that's what i plan on doing today and then something else i plan on doing is a vision board now surprisingly you know being the crafty diy queen that i am i have never done a vision board and I'm really surprised at myself that I've never done the vision board because like I said DIY queen all day I love to craft so yes yeah, so I'm basically gonna show you guys um, some of the things that I got um, so I found this poster board at the Dollar Tree of course and then I found all these different magazines um, we have a Forbes, we have an essence woman's health and funny thing is y'all I definitely bought this magazine because it says success on it so you know I'm hoping that 2021 will provide me with a lot of success okay and for the memory jar this year I did something different I didn't get well I couldn't find a, a mason jar and so I went and I found this like candle jar, I guess you can say. And I thought it was just cute and different. So I was like, let me try something different this year. So this is the jar that I'm going to be using. And then um, I went ahead. So this is my first time trying this. But I went ahead and got like um, fabric glue. Because I figured that I can like draw. I figured that I could draw and write things on the glass. So hopefully... <laughs> It works and it sticks. Then I also have um, this glitter that, oops, come on, let's focus. I got this um, variety pack of glitter that I will probably use maybe on my vision board. I don't know. And I'll try to maybe use it on the memory jar. But yeah, I'm going to actually show you guys. Um, I'm, I'm going to show you guys um, a few of my older um, memory jars so you guys can get an idea. So, one second. Y'all, so I wanted to show you guys um, examples of my 
we need we need to order food and I'm hungry and I know she's hungry and she's she just wanna give y'all content. Hold on. All right, you guys, so this is an example of a memory jar that I did back in 2016. As you can see, this is actually Eric and I's second date back in 2017. We went to go see Hidden Figures. I have this um, homecoming stub, um, Ruby State versus Lincoln. So, you know, just stuff like that. But yeah, Eric is here, chilling here, and then he's going to be watching college football as i'm here alabama versus notre dame working on my project comment down below who you think is going to win or who will when this is posted who you <laughs> thought was going to win who's your team nah this ain't my team i know it's not your team but who do you think is going to win alabama they're, alabama they're the, best. they're the number one seed so you know okay well Just also sitting here comfortably in my little bonnet. Who am I? I have no idea. But anyways, I just wanted to come on here and um, check in. Not really check in with y'all, but um, it's a couple of days since the last clip you saw me making my vision board. And I know I showed you guys a little clip. However, I didn't show you guys um, my memory jar. So, if you watched my last vlog, you all saw that Kavina and I were plotting on... Um, purchasing a Cricut and last week the Cricut came so instead of decorating the jar like how I plan on it with all those um, fabric glues and whatnot I decided to decorate my memory jar with my Cricut so I just want to come on here real quick and show you guys how it looks this is the memory jar you guys um it's kind of basic right now I just kind of wanted to see what I can do it came out really cute it was really easy it saved me a lot of time. I didn't have to wait for the fabric glue to dry. I just, you know, picked my design and printed it on a Cricut. So, really excited about that. Really glad that we purchased that Cricut. It was a great um, buy. Hey guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you all enjoyed. And I will see you in my next video.